Let's hope 19th century England is ready for the Jadoon. Coming soon from Big Finish Production. Michelangelo, who the blazes are you? Get back from the Hello, people of the internet. It is I, Henry Dudestop. Sorry I haven't made an effort to actually do any of this video. I'm going to start that again. Hello, people of the internet. This is I, Henry So Welcome you guys back to another Shout Out Friday video. And for once, it's actually on a, on a Friday. Sorry I haven't made an effort at all, I literally just woke up and I thought, oh sugar, I haven't recorded this video. So I'm doing it now. So as you can see, like, my room's all a bit messy and I haven't brushed my hair or anything. So anyways, let's go on to the top three shout outs of this week. Because I've got seven new subscribers in just one week. Thanks guys. So anyways, moving on to my number one. We have Calman Wester. I believe that's how you say your name, Weston, Callum, Callum, Callum Weston, Weston, however you say your name, um, yes, he also does a shout out, he does a shout out summary series, so if you want to get your chance of getting your own shout out, first off subscribe to me, and then there's um, about 500-ish more subscribers than me, so if you want to get another, one better shout out, most likely go to him. He also, I'm um, guessing he does a lot of challenge videos because on his YouTube channel I can see quite a lot of challenge videos. Thanks for subscribing to me and here's your shout outs. You probably won't get any more subscribers though because no one watched this series. Not right now! <laughs> Moving on to number two. We have the Doctor's Assassin 1. Um, he basically does news types of videos. He hasn't uploaded in like five years though, so yeah. Oh, the last video you did was seven hours ago. Just want to say you have a nice banner and a nice like image, but I'd say do the, your um, setup of, how, of your channel kind of how I have, because it's quite annoying when you have like most popular videos and just to go uh, jiggle around with your um, YouTube setup. Because it's easier to go from home page to videos to um, playlist. That's why I kind of have it set up, and it's much easier to do it from there. You might want to put like a channel trailer in the middle or something like that. Also, something that would really improve your uh, videos would be to add thumbnails. Because um, from your videos, I can see you don't really have like thumbnails, or maybe it's just like these recent videos. Uh, I can see he does like figure adventures, he does a lot of new news, whatever that is. You might want to put that into a playlist for any people who like to see news and stuff like that. Yeah, you seem like a very cool YouTube channel and I have seen you are a quite a bit active on some of my videos. More on my Doctor Who videos. Um, so yeah, that's quite cool. Thank you. Um, yeah, you, see, you, have to see, you seem like you have quite a lot of interesting videos, I can see you do like, a, lot of, a lot of figurey types of videos. I'm guessing you're trying to bandwagon on that Batman March train, you know what I mean. Anyways, moving on to my third and final one. And number three we have Dr. Freedom here with his news and pin around to Yoohoo Universe. Basically he does a lot of Doctor Who news and if you want to get up on some of the most recent Doctor Who news, he is the person to go to. I've also subscribed to his channel and he subscribed to me. Um, and I have meant to give him a shout out for some time now. He does some amazing videos. He talks about all the new stuff that's in and out of the Doctor Who universe. Um, it's quite cool and it's very like realistic in how he does his performance. Because he does say he just do he does it like just sticks a camera on and then there you go, the video's done because it doesn't really edit any of these videos. Anyway, you think, oh, well, why would people would watch that if we don't have people doing that stuff? Yeah. Whatever them words were. <laughs> um, if you want to see some more Doctor Who news, go uh, to his channel. He does like some thumb, he has some thumbnails and he just some, done some amazing videos. He doesn't know how to stick a camera in front of a computer, he has like a, um, uh, a screen capture and then also a camera and he does it where he's recording the screen and himself at the same time so they're both in the part of the same thing at the same time so 
yeah. He also does these things called the Omega Files, where they basically just talk about a Doctor Who story, or this, that, or the other on their thoughts, where they interview someone from like the actual Doctor Who series, or from other things like that. There are other things as well, but it is mainly Doctor Who, but there is some Star Wars and some other nerdy kind of things. So if you're into stuff like that, I don't even know if the camera's like that close. So if you like that kind of stuff, go to Doctor Freedom. He does do some amazing videos, and every time I see one of them pop-ups with the Doctor Who YouTube news things, I always click on them because I always like to see what's in and out of the universe. And plus, he's made some amazing videos while we have the 2016 Wilderness Year of the new series. So he has some amazing videos. So go check him out. Go see his some amazing videos. He just does loads of them. So anyways, thank you guys, see you in the next one. Bye!